This channel does not promote or encourage any illegal activities. All contents provided by this channel is meant for educational purpose only. Good morning, everyone. This is video number 12 from our Excel course. I hope you find it well. In this video, we are going to show one more function, subtotal. This function is used instead of another functions when you want to execute the filtered ranges. To get the purpose from this function, here you are the following example. We have a list of classes and the quantities, and the total for them, which is 700 as shown here. Now, if you filter to show only class A, the function can be used to make the total also filtered, or to make the total be applied only on the seen classes. Ignoring classes B and C, which is filtered. Syntax as shown. Equal subtotal and between two parentheses the arguments. The first argument is a function number. Here you have a list of the function can be used. And number nine is referring to some function. Then the second argument. Sequentially, is the arguments that some function can take. If some function takes only one argument, so you give one argument and close parentheses. Let's see it in Excel sheet. Here we go. The list is here. In the total, instead of saying equal sum function, we use subtotal function. Sub between two francs, the first argument will be a number. One, two, three, four, I choose here nine for some function. Second argument is the range. Now the range is here. So it gives 700. If I filtered here on plus A, I can see only 400 as it's sum here. Or I can use filter on P classes, so it's 200. This function is flexible with B. Thank you very much for watching this video. See you in the next one.